Cancer Singles, welcome. This is your singles read for December. I'm switching it up a little bit. Well, I'm having my, I have the cards already out. Instead of doing the Meet the Soulmate using eight cards, um, here I'm going to do uh, what I call Tarot Story Time. So I'll try to tell a story about your love life. And uh, go ahead and jump in with, uh, that shouldn't take long <laughs> if you want, um, but we'll take a minute with it and see. Uh, and I've tried to lay this out ahead of time, so really I can look at it, kind of think about it a little bit. So I can think about what story I want. Um, and it was just disastrous for Jim and I. <laughs> it was, but I have to go with the cards. What I keep saying is like, uh, the cards, they just say the truth, you know, they don't, they don't always tell us what we want to hear. The one reason I don't read for myself, it just doesn't work. Um, but here we have a, a really wonderful story. I think you've got something in store for you. So I see you, when you were young, you know, you may have uh, went to college. I don't really read the bottom of the deck here. Um, put this down, and I, I probably won't uh, clarify. But you may have went to college. You, you had some kind of a, uh, you didn't jump right into marriage early, uh, cancer. So um, you had some fun. And I see it next to the devil. Um, so uh, some excess, you know. I didn't really see this as you were, you know, a heroin addict or anything like that. Uh, but you really let loose and you know however this worked out for you it could just be good old-fashioned fun in the parking lot with angles behind the ears uh, it could involve also some obsessive behavior um, kind of we're going nine of cups in the devil you know it's partying hard you're partying hard it could definitely be that could be nine of cups in the devil could be the official uh, uh, a card for like college sorority life or something so, I mean, if it wasn't that exactly, then it was something similar. Um, and um, this brought you to your knees, you know. I think um, um, there may have been a physical episode even here, or just some kind of realization, like, this is kind of not working for me. Um, so, I don't know what that would have been. I mean, it could even have been rehab, guys. Or it could have been something like that, you know. Where it kind of really hits you that this is this is more now this is more than just having fun it's more than a, just a little bit out of, of control it's you going you know wow this is not practice this is life and you know um, I don't even remember really what happened last night you know um, I and maybe it's like getting to the point where I don't even know if it was fun because I don't really remember what happened. So it's just like partying really hard. Um, but I gotta think out of this, um, you meet someone. And I kind of see this Knight of Wands, uh, it's coming under the devil. Um, you might have been someone you met with in an affair. It might have been someone you met suddenly. It's someone you met sexually. You also have the strength card looking right at it. That's Leo. So keep that in mind, Cancer. It, sun, moon, rising, and Venus think with cancer energy because I think this could be what you're drawing in here. And with the page of pentacles, um, I think what that is, just showing that this is somebody maybe a little bit younger than you, but it's someone that's coming in very sincere and very strong. Um, and uh, you, this may have already happened. If this has not already happened, it could be happening. Uh, if it is happening, uh, you could be looking at a Leo person that also has Earth placements. Or an Earth person that has Leo placements. Could go either way. Uh, but that's the energy coming in. Um, I would kind of go with fixed Earth, so Taurus. Just because. Um, and it's a page. Um, so this is someone that comes in and I think it's like hits you at a right time. And maybe it's now. Maybe you're getting there maybe you will in the near future um because the way they hit you and this this uh, strength card the leo person here entity man or woman is looking right at your knight of wands um and you know this knight of wands particularly <laughs> this uh, gilded tarot deck of you see the volcano going off in the background there um so, um, I mean, you had some kind of realization about how tough it was, um, and you found someone in, it really kind of still in that energy, 
who happen, I think, to be the right one for you. Um, and this may have hit you with this Ace of Pentacles, uh, really uh, that they were grounded, that they meant it, that they were sincere. And I think it's like they say that when the student's ready, the master appears. Well, when the lover's ready, then the lover appears. And maybe that's what happened. Um, you just really have gotten to the point where you're tired with uh, shallower things and uh, you wanted something solid here and something real and sincere. And, and tell me, look at this now in the Gilded Terror Royale. Is that not the most sincerest looking lad you've ever seen your whole life? So this uh, person is uh, as sincere as the night is long, you know? And I think you, would, if you don't know that, you're going to know that. I think this, you'll see it in their face, you know? Uh, you're just, uh, um, it's gonna be kind of like just what you're looking for. Um, and maybe like a year ago or two years ago, you know, you would have seen this and, and been kind of not interested in it. Like it was uh, kind of boring or just kind of not cool. Now, <clears throat> look, guys, the Ace of Cups in the Hierophant here, I tell you, I might have a Taurus personality going on. So this is telling me um, that this person, this, this page, I believe, is the one that's going to offer you their cup of love. I think they're offering you their cup of love, you know, because uh, you have a page of Pentacles and you have an Ace. Um, and <clears throat> that brings a water sign into it. But more than a water sign, it brings real love. I mean, this person is very sincere. They're sincerely offering you. Um, they're probably offering marriage. I mean, I think there's a person here coming. If they're not already in your life, you don't know who I'm talking about. They're going to offer you marriage. And they're going to offer your cup. And they're going to offer it right from their heart. And I mean, the thing about this is, I think if I do them like this to show they're looking at each other. Um, this, I don't want you to get the idea that this is some boring uh, person that doesn't have any... Uh, <laughs> passion because that's passionate as hell um, and they're but they're meeting you in a very strong way it's like um, uh, um, this passion the sex which should be off the charts is going to be uh, more meaningful to you um, than what you've experienced before and like I say it's just it's really I think it's gonna like I hate to use the word maybe I'm a little hungry but I get the feeling in my gut like uh, like there's this hunger and, and you've been just, no matter what you eat, this is kind of like, you know, you're, you're going to the buffet and you're going back and you're going back and now you're having desserts. And it's like, you're just, you know, you're like probably thinking, geez, for all the money I paid and all the time I spent and all the different things, you think I could find one thing that was really what I want. And maybe you couldn't even figure what you want. Now here comes this page of Pentacles character and you find out that, damn, that's it. And you, how would you know until you met them, until you made love to them, until you dealt with them, that they really hit the spot. So, I mean, they're lighting you up, you know, romantically, sexually. They're there for you. Um, and they're sincerely offering you a cup of love. And this, look, you're going, look what you're going from, from one corner to the other. <laughs> you're going from the bachelor, and like I say, a little bit wild bachelor cancer, to married life, ring, ding, ding, ding. So, Invite me to the wedding, and if it uh, resonates, I hope it's helpful. Um, do subscribe, hit the bell, tell a friend, tell a friend. Thank you, guys.